First at noon, we continue our coverage on a shooting that happened at a graduation birthday party last night at the Vista View apartment complex here in Charleston. Police say 37-year-old Dennis Butler showed up with an AR-15 and started shooting. Now, what police say could have been a mass casualty event was stopped by a bystander. Eyewitness News reporter Ava Rash has been covering the latest developments for us all morning. And Ava, it sounds like that woman was in the right place at the right time. Lauren, you are exactly right. Police say that she was legally carrying a concealed pistol. She shot Butler multiple times, stopping him from shooting dozens of people, including children. Now, whenever I spoke to police this morning, they told me that he was approached early on in the night for speeding throughout that area near the party. Investigators say he then left, came back about 30 minutes later, parked in front of the 1300 complex, got into the back seat of his car where that AR-15 was, and began firing into the crowd. That woman took action, shot and killed Butler. Now, Lieutenant Tony Hazel says no one was injured and that this woman did the right thing. This lady was carrying a lawful firearm, okay, a law-abiding citizen who stopped the threat of probably 20 to 30 people being killed. She engaged the threat and stopped it. She didn't run from the threat. She engaged it, preventing a mass casualty here in Charleston. And I think that was now, this is a picture from 2018 of Butler from a previous arrest. Police say Butler had an extensive criminal history. They still are not exactly sure how he got that gun. Now, all witnesses and the woman are cooperating with police. And as of right now, no charges are being brought against that woman. For now, reporting at police headquarters, Ava Rash, eyewitness.